Friday everyone and welcome to our first tricky word phonics session. So we're not going to do our sounds today, we'll do them again on Monday. But for now, we are going to go through all the tricky words that we have learned before. We're then going to learn a couple of new ones, see if we can spot them in sentences, play a little game and to finish, we will be reading the story we've been working on all week in full. Okay, let's go through our tricky words then. Are we ready? I A The Two No Go Right, now even faster. You ready? I, A, the, two, no, go. Okay, so this week we are going to be learning two new words. He and she. So let me show you he is he. And let's have a look at she. So we'll have a look one more time at he. Here we go. And she one more time. Okay, now I'm going to switch between the two and see if you can tell me which word it is. I'm going to join in as well. Ready? He. She. He, she, she, or oh, did anyone get tricked there? He. A very well done, everyone. Okay, what we're going to do now, I'm going to put up a few sentences. Don't worry about reading the rest of the words unless you want to or unless you feel you can, but see if you can spot either he, she, or both in the sentences. I'm gonna only play them for about five seconds, so if you need longer then please do pause the video. Okay, the last thing, tricky word-wise, is just to go over and practice one more time the tricky words that we already knew before we learned the two. And that is a little game. You can either do it now or later on today. Either is absolutely fine. I've linked it at the bottom of this video. So see if you can find it in the comments. If not, it should be in the daily email that you've been sent as well. And it is a really good game just to practice hearing the words and spotting which one it is. If you click phase two and then random and it should pop up with random balloons and you've got to pop the correct one or find the correct one. So I hope you really enjoy that as well. Okay, so the final thing today is to put together all the hard work that we've been doing this week, learning that um, that new book, Goldilocks and the Three Bears. So what I would love is for a grown up or a brother or sister to hear you read the whole of the Goldilocks and the Three Bears book today. Again, as always, I will be putting their slides um, just at the end here, but if you'd prefer to use the PDF, then that is absolutely fine as well. Thank you so much for all your engagement, all of your hard work this week. It is so appreciated. And I hope that you have a wonderful weekend, whatever you're up to. I'll look forward to seeing you again on Monday. Bye for now.